Hey guys, welcome back to another Minecraft Redstone tutorial and today we're looking at a 3x3 piston door in Minecraft 1.18 So let's get straight into it And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing if you enjoyed the video and leave me a big fat thumbs up if you like it Now let's get straight into what you're going to need So this is what we're going to be building today A 3x3 piston door looks really complicated it's pretty complicated, I'm not going to lie, this is one of my simple ones, but uh, it is super fun, so let's get straight on with it. Uh, what are you going to need today? You're going to need 10 sticky pistons, one regular piston, two droppers, 10 observers, two redstone repeaters, one lever, eight redstone dust, nine blocks of your choice. I'm using diamond blocks, because flex, and nine pink wool. Or any wool of your choice or any block that you want so it looks complicated but it's not look at the door so I've used different colored blocks so you're only moving nine blocks uh, wait three six seven eight nine yeah nine blocks <laughs> you're only moving nine blocks and it's not actually that hard so it's 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 we've done this before this is a double piston extender and the rest is all really quite straightforward. Okay guys, so what we're gonna do is get started on building this three by three piston door. So what we're gonna do first of all is place down our one block of pink wool with some redstone dust on top and then a ooh, an observer facing into the, the block, so the signal goes into the block and then a dropper on the front there. Next, we are going to put some wool with another observer facing the same direction. That's the bottom layer done. Easy as that. Next, we want an observer facing up on top of our first observer, and then we want an observer facing that way, the opposite direction to the ones on the bottom like so and then we want two sticky pistons facing up and then i'm going to break this brock here because we want a regular piston facing down and then we are going to put our sandstone back so it looks better and then lastly we are going to put some pink wool on the end with some red dome dust on top and that's your bottom layer done i'm not going to put any of the diamond blocks on top of here yet we will do that at the end so the next thing you're going to do is build up the left hand side so what we're going to do is place a piston on top of our upwards facing observer like so and then we're going to face an observer into our redstone dust like that next you're just going to build up the side of this piston uh, piston door like so three sticky pistons on top of each other easy Right, next thing we're going to do is build the top part here, which is uh, kind of easy. It's going to be three pink blocks like so, with redstone dust on top of them like so. It's easy, right? This build is a bit more complicated than we used to, I grant you, but it's still not too bad not too bad at all uh right uh an observer on top of here with the red dot on this side so the signal goes out into here and then from here we're going to put two sticky pistons on here which is a double piston extender and then uh from there we just need to have the last few bits which is an observer actually we will put in our pink block here I'm just going to put a block, a temporary block on here, and then we're going to have a observer facing into that wool block. And then from there, we're going to put a dropper on the side like so with some redstone dust on the top. Easy. And then we're going to put two observers on top of that. Both facing that way as well and then we want repeaters on top of that facing in the same direction one on one tick one on four ticks like so four ticks one tick and then you need to put in your block up here which is where your signal is going to come in and then next thing we're just going to put the blocks on the side for the piston door so this is two sticky pistons facing in this direction and then 
lastly, we're coming down to the bottom again. So we're going to come down here with our uh, observer there. And then lastly, two blocks on here. And that's the... I mean, that's all the workings done. So now we're just going to put in our blocks of choice for our door. So we're going to have three on that side, three on the bottom, two on this side, and one on the top. And that's it. And if I've done it right, which I probably haven't, but if I have done it right, then that should be our 3x3 three three door done. And then all you do is make your entrance like so. Oh, it's beautiful. It's so, so beautiful. I I like that so much. That's so good. Uh, right. And uh, you can make these all day long. The 3x3 three three pistols are amazing to do. You could, of course, do them with flying machines. This is so much more satisfying. <laughs> Uh, right, and that is it. That's how you make a 3x3 piston door. I hope you've enjoyed the video. I've enjoyed making it, as always. If you have enjoyed it, please consider subscribing. It really helps me out. And most of you aren't subscribed. And as always, leave me a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments what your thoughts on the video were. And uh, thanks so much for joining me. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.